Sneaky is back tonight, and tonight we've got Z. And no, not the mark of Zorro, it's Zevin OS. Based on Zubuntu Karmic Koala, we can have a little look around and show you what it's got. On the desktop, you've got the usual icons so you've got Home, File System, Waste Basket, Disk Manager, First Config Little Thing, and Magi 2. So, what we'll do, we'll look at Magi 2 first. Basically, it's a little installer, so you can install the OS there, file managers there, the archivers there, a little searchy, system settings, screenshot even, console, and software installation for command line. So that's pretty good. And Office, you've got your word processor, spreadsheet, presentation, etc. Internet, it's all there. Basically, it's like a widget bar without the widget bar. It's just a little easier thing so you can get to bits. Watch and record TV, burning that, etc. etc. Video editing. So, so we have got video editing. So I got Kino here. Let's have a quick look. Kino comes up. That's nice, but it's Avid Emux instead, not Kino. Very good. Maybe that's because I like Avid Emux. Maybe not. When you actually close down a screen, you just click there, not there. So we'll go like that. Easy peasy. Video player that will be VLC. I take it this way. No, it's a movie player. Maybe it's not VLC, but it looks like it because it's got the icon. But what am I to know? I've only just installed it on this new system I've got here. So we'll have a look around again. Editor, Gambax, Genie, and finally all your settings. Looks pretty okay to start with, doesn't it? Now bear in mind it is based on Zubuntu, which is unusual again. I done that one the other night. I rather like it. We'll go down to Applications. It's all the usual that you would get a new Ubuntu distribution, but then some, some extras. So if we go down to Multimedia, my favourite section as you all know, you get Audacious, Audacity, Avid Emux, already as standard, GTK record my desktop as standard. I actually put XFID Cat on just to make sure it worked on this one, and it does. It hasn't got the problem I had with Ubuntu before, so that's worked out. Your music player, is a rhythm box. There we go. Super duper. All works quite quick as well. I was quite pleased about that. Go down to apps again. Uh, for your office, you've only got a bit Abbey Word and Numeric. Obviously, if you go to Synaptic, you can get some other stuff. So what we'll do, we'll go to Synaptic. Go down to System and Synaptic. Put your password in. And whoops, your uncle. Up it comes. Super duper. So what would we look for? We would really look for if you want to do office stuff. Some of you would want open office. So we'll put open office in. There we go. And we'll see what comes up. Which should be quite a bit. So we go down, 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 Anyway, I'm scrolling down here. I'm not actually far. Ah, there we are. Open office. So, you normally click there, then it would add all the extras for you. So, it's all there for you. So that's another super duper one. Liking it. It's really, really quick, as you can see, too. We'll go down to network tools. You've got claws mail for your mail. I would prefer Thunderbird, but who am I to say? And Firefox for your web browser. That should come up any second now. As you can see in the corner, you've got your little icon box with all your bits and bobs and your workspaces. So what we'll put in, we'll go to getting started, just to make sure the net's working very slowly. As you can see, lovely works. We'll use Google. We'll go to the BBC. There we go. We'll get to the home page. And as you know, this is a really slow loader anyway. We'll see how long it takes to load. Now, it's thinking about it. And that's as far as we're getting so far. Very, very slow tonight. I do apologise if it keeps on. Oh, no, it did come in the end. Right, let's have a look there. What do we got? We'll click on there to make sure Flash is installed, I think. But I'm not sure if I'm going to be bothered to wait because my internet has just stalled again. Don't like that. Terrible. It does come up in the end. Super. We'll just wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. I wouldn't mind he's not even got his Xbox on tonight. It's terribly, terribly slow. Click today. Does he work? We'll count to five. We'll count to four. Lovely. Working super. 
as you can see the frame rate capture is nice and good on here to make sure the actual program starts there you go super duper nice now on the whole I rather like using this it's a bit of a change from the usual Zubuntu, Ubuntu, Kubuntu desktop and if you want to go into more there is more you can get from it as we will see if you go to the settings again you can change all the XFCE settings for you, the Windows Manager you can play about it and really customise it for what you want to do now on the whole I really like it I've used record my desktop this time to record as well just to see what it's like and see if I have to do any editing blah 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 but hey love it sneaky Linux out